None of those theories take account of the fact that Atlantis is a flood myth and that it is part of a global tradition of flood myths. I, I, I don't think that, uh, that any of them provide a satisfactory example. The most interesting thing is that there are a number of places in the world which were radically changed by sea level rise at the end of the Ice Age. So you've got a combination of sea level rise and isostasy. It is possible. But there are other intriguing areas of the world. There's uh, the Sunda Shelf. That's I mentioned earlier. The, 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 the landmass that now on maps is the Malay Peninsula, the Malaysian Peninsula, the Indonesian islands. Um, that landmass was, was, it was all one landmass during the Ice Age. Uh, it wasn't a peninsula and a series of islands. It was called, geologists call it the Sunda Shelf or Sunda Land. Um, and, and that was submerged very rapidly uh, at the end of the last Ice Age, changed everything completely.